Bloggy blog time. We are back from Connecticut, the uh, first night back from Connecticut, and we are making a wonderful dinner. So we started off by making this guacamole, chicken avocado, finely diced onion, finely diced tomato, salt, pepper, uh, a little bit of garlic salt, off one clove of fresh pressed garlic, um, lime juice, the cristal, cristal hot sauce. And this other stuff called it's called pirata. It's called molho de ajo. It's some kind of garlic sauce we got from I believe it came from South America. Some one of our relatives is a one of my girl's relatives is a flight attendant. And what else we put in there? That's it, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, and cumin and cumin also. And then my girlfriend made this wonderful corn salsa. It's uh, mild pepper rings red, orange, and yellow, and fi finely diced tomatoes. Oh, there's also cilantro in here. In here there is also cilantro. And also in here she put cilantro, salt, pepper, garlic, cilantro, diced tomatoes, the, the pepper rings, and lime juice. And the corn is actually raw, and I've been cooking 24 years, and I found out from my girlfriend who doesn't cook very much that you can eat corn raw because she looked it up and she got this recipe. So here's what we're going to do. Also show them the sugar cane. She also got the sugar cane. This thing is awesome. I've never seen a sugar cane like this. It's humongous. See this? It looks kind of looks like my uh, pants. Mm -hmm. And uh, you could actually beat someone down with that. So here's what we're going to do for tonight's healthy dinner. We've got two nice big leaves of uh, romaine. And we're going to take some guacamole. Guacamole. You guys should play guacamole on the Xbox if you have it. It's a free download. It's, it's a very fun game. So we're going to lay the guacamole. Guacamole on just one. Mm -hmm. oh, sorry. Guacamole on the lettuce leaves. Spread it out a little bit. Then we're gonna switch over to this lovely corn salsa. I don't like the peppers as much as she does, so I'm gonna try to make my more corn and tomato and less pepper. Put that on there. Put it on the other one. Hers with the nice peppers on it. And there you go, nice, healthy, we don't have a name for it, what can we call this? Mm. You don't know? We call this, uh, corn, wrap. corn salsa and guacamole lettuce wraps. Look how beautiful those are, and believe me, they taste just as good as they look. And thanks for watching Bloggy Blog Time Dinner Edition. Alright. <laughs> okay, I'm back, and my girlfriend wants to be distracting now, with her little shenanigans. Anyway... The reason I'm back is because I didn't think of this before, and I should have. So instead of making these being corn, salsa, and guacamole lettuce wraps, they are going to be, since we had this, I'm going to, this mahi here. I'm going to grind up this mahi. I'm going to put it inside. And it's basically going to be a corn, salsa, guacamole, and mahi lettuce wrap burrito. Boom. Look at that. This mahi is really nice. It's got it's grilled with a little lemon, salt, pepper, garlic on it. Look how it shreds. I'm doing the camera work now. My cameraman's uh, eating. She don't have time for this. And Sorry. So I'm shredding this up. I got two lettuce leaves, so I'm going to use half of this fish for this one. Look how nice that's shredding. It's beautiful. It's a nice hearty fish. It's almost like meat. It's so uh, thick. So there you go. We're watching The Strain. The two episodes we missed while we're on vacation, and we're having... Uh, corn salsa, guacamole, and mahi lettuce wrap fish burritos. Booyah. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. All that good stuff. Bye.